the Zebra BI Tables Visual allows several options for sorting. You can sort in one click by any column that is added to your Zebra BI Visual, uh, as well as set a custom order uh, in the situations where you want to have a fixed sort order of your data categories. Let me show you how it works. So by default, all the data is always sorted by the actual value. This is just the default in Zebra BI tables because many times uh, sorting on the actual values makes most sense, but you can simply change this by clicking once on the column header. Now I have set the order to descending or clicking once more which actually sets the whole visual in the custom sort mode, which I will explain a little later. Um, in the same manner, you can simply sort by the absolute variance, ascending, descending, and also the relative variance uh, to display, for example, the fastest growing data elements or, you know, the laggards here. So this is one click sort by a column in the Zebra BI tables. Uh, this is not working only in the design view. This is also working in the view mode. The view mode meaning once you publish the report, the end users, the consumers can do the same uh, in Power BI service and even in the Power BI mobile apps, right? This experience uh, can be controlled. So in certain cases, you would probably also um, wants to prevent the end users to sort. There are certain situations where this makes sense. So that's why there are uh, several options here in the interaction group of settings where you can actually set the functionality of sorting for the end users, for the view mode to off. This means that the sort order as you have it right now in your Power BI desktop uh, will be fixed and the end user will not be able to change it. Right? By, by default, the sorting is an enabled also in the uh, view mode, so everybody can sort in Power BI service and in the mobile apps. Now, there are certain situations where you would want to set a custom order of your data elements uh, in your tables. Uh, for example, sorting uh, by geography, by country uh, in a sales dashboard or sorting your income statements by the account, custom account order, right? In this uh, case, you need to make sure that you click uh, two times on the uh, header, uh, for example, the actual column, and just make sure that this little down arrow is uh, cleared, right? So you will notice that once you sort the little arrow here is just indicating the sort order. Now I have the ascending order, uh, descending order. Now I have ascending order. The third time the arrow is gone, meaning that my whole visual is now in the custom sort mode. This means that the Power BI will actually set the sort here. So if you click on the three dot menu, you can now um, set the sort by field to, for example, your groups of your elements and, for example, ascending. What have I achieved now? I have actually set the alphabetical order of my data elements here. All right, so most of the time the alphabetical order actually does not make sense, but you can use the same functionality, for example, in the income statements. In the income statements, it is of vital importance that you get your sort order right, uh, the, the order of your accounts right. So, for example, first you will have certain revenue elements, right, and, uh, you know, maybe a result for the total revenue, then you have the um, operating costs, and then the gross margins, and so on. So there's always just one sort order that makes sense. So in this case, make sure again that, you're, that you are not uh, sorting by any of the columns in your uh, Zebra BI table because this just does not make any sense. Just make sure you click one, two, two times so that the little down arrow is 
cleared. Now your um, visual is in the sort mode. Again, you click on the three dot menu, you say sort by, and you make sure that you set the sort by data field to, for example, your accounts. And in the next step, sort ascending by the accounts, right? So this is how you control the uh, sort uh, options in your Zebra BI tables. Um, I invite you to our um, uh, knowledge base, um, learn more about income statements and other functionality of the Zebra BI visuals. Thank you.